story of the movies. Operation Blackout, episode 15. Today, we are covering only the first, the original, Marvel Zombies. Written by Robert Kirkman, which you probably know know for the Walking Dead comics. But the story is set in an alternate universe where the world's superhero population has been infected with a virus which turned them into zombies. The series was spun out of the events of the crossover story arc of Ultimate Fantastic Four, where the zombie Reed Richards tricked his ultimate counterpart part into opening a portal to the zombie universe only for the later to contain the former from ever coming to his universe. Sure, this took out, took on the form of many spin-offs, but we're only talking about the first one. But they call this Earth, Earth 2149. But yeah, it, it has zombie versions of the Avengers, X Men, and Fantastic Four. But it's interesting because the one that sacrifices himself to let Ultimate Fantastic Four escape is Magneto. But Silver Surfer and his master Galactus arrive to devour the planet. But the zombies attack the Silver Surfer who is overpowered and devoured by several of the former superheroes. They call Captain America Colonel America in this universe. Iron Man, Giant Man exists in this universe. Spider-Man, Luke Cage, the Hulk, and Wolverine. Yeah, they absorb, they have a portion of the power cosmic. They slaughter most of the zombies. But their hunger grows and grows. But the only one that wasn't affected by the zombie virus was apparently Magneto. Wait, no. Black Panther. Because he's been kept alive by Giant Man as a food source because Giant Man is trying to find a cure. But Black Panther is missing a, an arm and a foot. But Zombie Wasp gets into an argument with her husband where she discovers he was hoarding the Black Panther. He promptly decap- decapitates Zombie Wasp by biting her head off, which remains sentient. After observing the wasp head, begging for the flesh, Black Panther reasons that hunger is more physiological than physical. Meanwhile, the zombies have decided that the flesh of other zombies just isn't satisfying. Galactus then arrives on Earth and is attacked by the zombies, but repels them easily. Giant Man, Iron Man, and Bruce Banner create a device that amplifies the powers they gain from the Silver Surfer. And together with Colonel America, Luke Cage, Spider-Man, and Wolverine, they are able to injure Galactus. The cosmic-powered zombies fight off zombified versions of several supervillains. Although Colonel America is killed by the Red Skull and then proceed to devour Galactus, Giant Man, the Hulk, Iron Man, Luke Cage... Spider-Man and Wolverine are then infused with Galactus's cosmic 
power cosmic. The group thus becomes collective Galacti. And then five years later, Black Panther, the Accolades, and the Wasp restored with a cybernetic body return to Earth to find the planet depopulated. Unknowing to them, the zombie Galacti have taken their hunger to the stars. In the final scenes, an intelligent alien race on a, a distant planet is fearful of the coming of Galactus, as they can see the signs of his imminent arrival in the night sky. To their horror, the zombie Galacti land on their world and instead and immediately begin to consume the populace. I would cover the sequels to the Marvel Zombie series, but that would just take too long. But next time on Operation Blackout, it is episode 16, and I will be covering the entire Doom Patrol run by Gerard Way. Until next time, listeners, stay safe and peace. Later, Gators. This is Roan signing off.